turn HVAC on. Set temperature to 72. Increase temperature to 72 degrees. There we go. Wipers to auto. Wipers to automatic. Increase wiper speed. That's good. Increase wiper speed. Play top hits. Defroster. Send the message to Scott Kubo. What is your ETA? Pause audio. Stop music. Okay, sounds good. Turn off front defroster. Turn off front defroster. Stop music. Show energy graph. Cool. Show backup camera. Set wipers to intermittent. Now to answer uh, some questions that have come up, uh, some of you have asked me, what is Tesla using for their voice recognition? And while we really don't know yet, uh, my guess is they're using Google. And the reason is twofold. One, Tesla for some time has had uh, voice recognition for navigation and quite a bit of vocabulary around addresses and places on the map. And while Tesla is using their own uh, in-house routing and navigation, we do know for quite some time they've used Google for their maps, uh, at least in the United States. And so that would make sense. They would also be using Google for their navigation voice recognition. Uh, you would think it would make sense that they would um, use the same uh, for these new voice commands. And I've noticed that some of the misinterpretations of more uh, un uncommon phrases um, seem to be quite similar between uh, the Google Voice Assistant and Tesla. Point the vents up. Hey Siri, point the vents up. Sorry, I didn't quite catch that. Could you please repeat it? Point the vents up. Sorry, I didn't quite catch that. Could you please repeat it? Hey, Scott Kubo. So that's not proof, but uh, that's where my bets are. 
Uh, if you know something other than I do, uh, let me know and uh, let me know what other questions you have. Thank <laughs> you.